Hi, my name is Ludas Butkus, and in this video I want to talk about a recent ICO that happened uh, and already finished earning it, well, and it got investments of around 32 million. This fluctuates because it was invested with cryptocurrency, so if the Bitcoin price goes up, the invested amount goes up a bit as well. And uh, the ICO is called Polybius. Uh, the project here is to create a bank, a cryptocurrency bank. Uh, they have a lot of plans actually. Uh, one of it is to start a sort of a fund where they would invest into other promising ICOs. Also, they want to do a online ID in identification, some sort of thing. And there are many m more ideas that they have they, that they are planning on launching uh, soon. Uh, but right now, it, it is only already like a week or two after the ICO has ended. So uh, the price of the Polybius token was $10. Right now, it is actually going up after well i talked about it yesterday everything is going down like 40 50 percent and the market is just crashing and even though polybius has crashed a lot and as you can see in the price chart it was even a dollar 60 dollar 50 so it had crashed a ton and actually this is dollars and the price was in euro so the price in euros has dropped even lower than it was probably like a dollar and euro 50. So that's a huge crash, but what we see now is 38% increase in price. So why this is happening? Well, it's because Polybius recently destroyed the unsold tokens. All unsold tokens have been destroyed and now the current supply is almost 4 million as you can see right back here it says circulating supply 3.7 and total supply almost 4 million Polybius tokens so uh, the market cap probably stayed the same uh, the tokens the amount of tokens dropped so the price increased naturally and it's now only half the price of the ICO. Uh, Polybius got into exchanges very quickly after the ICO. Um, I was participating in another ICO Exudo and it has passed almost a month and not a single exchange or, well, they haven't really launched their project yet. so. So Polybius was really quick at started at starting trading their um, tokens. So in the charts you can see it is four dollars forty five cents, but here we see four dollars ninety five cents. So I think there is a little bit of lag here because it's not a popular, uh, not that popular asset right now. It's only 83rd uh, in the list, but it was actually somewhere at the bottom when it was around the price of $2, $3. So it's going back up and it now has a pretty decent place. So what's, what else is new? If you had participated, the bounty campaign is actually... Uh, coming to an end and you should probably see your tokens in around a week mostly two weeks time so uh, your bounty isn't lost it will be in a week or so and lastly i wanted to show you that it is on live coin and you can start trading it Let's just look at this. Oh, where is it? Oh, here. So yeah, 
Polybius is four dollars thirty nine cents at bid and ask at four nine, which is a few cents higher than that. So it's an ICO that I believe in. Um, it's kind of a bummer that it actually dropped to a dollar fifty. If I invested at this price instead of the ICO, I would have much more Polybius tokens, but you can never know. Though it was a lesson that usually Polybius, <laughs> that usually ICO uh, token prices drop after the ICO, and that has happened for several ICOs, and probably uh, this was even a major factor because the price of a single token was really high, it was 10 euros, so I think it was kind of expected to go down, and also the overall market structure that is currently, where everything is going down, didn't help Polybius at all. So I'm looking into the future, um, waiting for my bounty, and then I will calculate uh, my investment and I will be holding because Polybius is going to be paying dividends yearly so I'm going to look what are they going to launch, how is it going to look etc and I believe they will go back to the 10 euros and even even more. So hope you enjoyed this video, hope it was helpful and see you in the next one.